Hello, in today's video, I'm going to be showing off a secret addition to Wordacune that you probably didn't know about. There's a submarine now. However, the submarine is not at the docks. It's somewhere else. So, I'm gonna go get the submarine real quick. Yep, just gonna go on the tank shed. Uh, here's a submarine. It's a very, very good submarine, if I may say. So, now... I just gotta drive the sub into the water, and it'll be submarining and all that. All the good stuff that you need to have for a submarine. So, I go into the water, and voila! Submarine is ready to go. So, I'm gonna be giving you some epic gameplay of my submarine. First up, we're gonna attack this guy's shield over here. Ooh. Looks like we got a green right now. Submarine is overall doing very well against it. I can only worry about javelins in the water because I can't really do much while I'm submerged. And the submarine is a pretty bad one in my opinion in the matter that it can't unsubmerge. It's stuck in the water from my knowledge. Once you submerge it, you can't re-emerge. And boom, we got their shield. Unless they got it themselves. We have to check. We have to check to make sure. Nah. Well, that's pretty sad. So now we have Echo. What's up, man? Oh, yeah. He's not ready for this, man. Uh-huh. Submarine is going really well. Oh, my gosh. Is that a fighter? Oh, yeah. Enemy F-16. So, my favorite way to aim with the submarine is actually going to be this. So, I need to make sure I get a good view of him. Oh, it's gone. That means I looked like I got the turret or something. Looks like the F-16 is gone, though. I don't think I'm gonna chase it either. Pursuing an F-16 to a sub, it can be pretty annoying to do. Overall, planes are pretty maneuverable compared to submarines, in my opinion, and I don't like doing it. You know, I'm just gonna skip to a head when I do get my first kill, or just before I get my first kill, so there'll be a bit more context. Oh, crap, enemy submarine. I repeat, enemy submarine. Ah, shit, dude. Ah, shit. I wasn't suspecting an enemy sub, man. We gotta launch torpedoes. I repeat, launching torpedoes. Oh, yeah, man. This submarine is... Well, it's the best submarine, to say the least, dude. Look at this punk. He thought he was better than me and my submarine. I am the best submarine user. Oh crap, this guy might be getting a boat. <laughs> Bro's never heard of submarine meta. Okay, uh. <laughs> oh, I got a direct hit. Didn't have to cut forward at all, it turns out, actually. Honestly, submarine, it's pretty good. I think a submarine needs to be able to emerge from the water, but otherwise, this submarine. It's pretty good, that man. Also, to those who say this is a tank, it's not a tank, man. It's a submarine. Oh, wow. That's, uh... Ay -ay -ay -ay. Scary, man. Oh, yeah, something... Uh, boats. Boats can't be repaired. Same goes for the submarine, since it's kind of a boat. It's not a boat. It's not a boat at all. It's a submarine. But, yeah, the submarine can't be repaired unless you could somehow get it to emerge. But I don't know any ways to do that yet. See, I'm gonna dock the sub at my base again, man. That's just some... Not that good of submarine gameplay. I'm sure you guys can get some better submarine gameplay. But yeah, that's a submarine, man. I hope you enjoyed that little tiny little cut of content there. I just wanted to bring awareness, mostly. I didn't want to show any, any gameplay that much. But it's a pretty good, man. It's pretty good. I really like the large amount of missiles it has. Very fun. So yeah, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I... Uh, I wish you well, man. Have a good day.